We want to make sure that our customer feels connected um, and is able to use our systems and products in a way that they want to do. More and more we're finding that the customers want to shop in a way that suits them, which means you really have to operate in a truly omni-channel world. Boots was founded in 1849 by John Boot as a high street chemist. It's a, um, an icon that literally everybody in the UK recognises. We've got people in their 80s and 90s who have shopped at Boots all their life. There's a real brand loyalty within the UK. Working for an organisation like Boots is really powerful because you really have the opportunity to impact on, on people's lives in a truly meaningful way. As a healthcare provider, We've been at the front line of the, the national response to COVID. We very quickly mobilised testing centres. We have helped with the vaccination programme. We, we've really kind of got to the, to the heart of, of helping the nation's response. From a digital perspective, we had some really interesting challenges. Historically, we have a um, old monolithic application um, in our estate. So almost overnight, the volume of orders on boots.com went through the roof. Suddenly we were experiencing Black Friday peak volume, but in the middle of March. We normally do a huge amount of preparation work. We look at our systems, we make sure that um, they're able to, to cope, that your databases are responding in, in a timely fashion. If something like a database starts to slow down or queries become non-performant, um, it really can have a, a massive impact. If, what if a database query is, is failing 5% of the time, 10% of the time? You think about that in the context of, of working in, in pharmaceuticals or in the healthcare industry. So that might mean that a customer is waiting for a test result or trying to access something which is really critical to their lives. And if we get it wrong, that can actually have devastating emotional consequences on an individual. We want to minimise that as much as we can. We want to make sure we've got robust and reliable technology supporting our whole technology estate. We have in the past had, had multiple different database technologies in our stack and we found that's been really challenging because our engineers have had to maintain different skill sets and get to grips with different types of technology that works in, in subtly different ways. But actually what we really want is our engineers to have deep and meaningful knowledge in a smaller number of technologies so that we can really make sure we're leveraging the best of that technology and really engaging with that technology's going. One of the things we found by coming to Mongo is that Mongo's really thought about, well, what might we need to do within the application? What, what operations might we want to perform on data? And how can that be simplified in some way? MongoDB is an obvious choice. One really great example of that is in relation to field level encryption. So um, we used to have a separate solution for field level encryption inside Boots, and which meant engineers had to write extra code that had to connect to another third party application the feature to include field level encryption within the MongoDB. It makes life really easy for us. We launched our new homepage to Azure earlier this year. So things like our order management system have already been rebuilt in a modern architecture. Mongo, at the heart of our order management system, enabled us to, to scale easily, um, enabled us to um, leveraging the, the, the power of the cloud, and we were able to quickly test performance, and we found that Mongo was, was definitely the best choice to do that. As an organisation, they're very forward-thinking. I'm always looking at what new features they might want to introduce, how, how that might affect us, how we can leverage that in a new and better way. Technology has unintended consequences literally every day. So as soon as we've written something, it goes out into the wild, someone will use that technology in a way we haven't considered. It means people are picking up on our technology and using it in new and innovative ways, but it also means that our technology can have a direct and meaningful impact on people's lives. Selecting MongoDB for us, this is about setting up a center of excellence and really making sure that people know how we engage with data right across the organization and making sure that we're um, able to leverage that data in the most seamless and efficient way possible.